This past weekend's historic blizzard pummeled areas like northern New Jersey with over two feet of snow. But if you stumbled upon the Parikh family residence on Henry Street in Paramus, you would have been none the wiser. The house on this side has a large solar photovoltaic system that produces energy. When the That's a C. Parik, a Manhattan-based real estate agent describing the one-of-a-kind self-sufficient home he built with his engineer father, Raj. That, among other things, features a heated driveway and walkway that melted snow from this weekend's storm an inch and a half every hour. I, honestly, I did th I threw the shovels out and even sold my uh, snow machine because I wanted to make sure that I don't, would not need it. The home they call Zenis's house, which took three years to build, captures rainwater all year round and then uses a solar thermal system to heat that water, which eventually makes its way to a network of heating pipes underneath the concrete. The solar heat collectors above, which are heating up water, come into this system and right now, as we speak, the water coming in is 128 degrees. The system, which maintains the home's temperature on the coldest and hottest of days, is developed to not let anything go to waste, as even the melted snow collected from the driveway and walkway gets recycled back into the home and later used for laundry, irrigation, and toilet water. The key is with Zenis's house, we wanted to not buy a boiler, not buy an air conditioning system, not buy a hot water heater, and do everything with the earth and sun. This one-of-a-kind technology for now only exists here in Paramus. The Parik family say they're in the process of patenting their eco-friendly house that has incredible economic benefits. The family's typical monthly PSENG bill is two or three dollars as they're generating more energy than they're using. The home, which is still under construction, did cost a pretty penny to build, an estimated $250 per square foot. But according to a C. Parikh, it's an investment that will pay dividends in the long run, especially in a city like New York. Those apartment complexes get developed. They can be built both more luxuriously, with more light, with more uh, comfortable interiors, with fresher air, and with more sustainable and luxurious features like a snowmelt system and green roofs. In Paramus, I am Angie Ramos, PIX 11 News.